Hello everybody, Amic Levels here. Welcome back. We are taking a look today at the 1 billion units uh, experimental mapping challenge. This was, I think, like 3 days or 70 some odd hour challenge um, to make a map with a 1 billion units. Um, a lot of people seem to have trouble with that. I, I don't know, it seems kind of weird. You learn how to calculate volume of an area in like high school geometry class, so if you can imagine in terms of hammer, like an eight-story high building, and that is like a giant cube, that's around approximately a billion units. Um, but of course, area is, uh, you know, if you make something not eight stories tall, you can, you can make something smaller and wider, or you can make like a tunnel that you walk around in for an hour, and that would be a billion units as well. I'm right here, I'm not lost. I got my crowbar and, and everything. Alright, so since this is a... Uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Download link is in the description. <laughs> Time code for the second map is also in the description. And since this is an experimental mapping challenge, I'm, I'm gonna stay away from talking about aesthetics. Kind of? Unless anything is like grotesquely bad or anything. And, um, mostly, mostly focusing on the gameplay today. Antlions. Okay. I saw the vent thingy. Nothing? Let there be light. Where did you come from? Oh, the door opened because it's a powered door. I guess that makes sense. A door to another door. Hmm. I I kind of Crouch. Dismount. There we go. Okay. Then I was just making sure. I was like, why is there a secret thingy here? Oh man. No, don't do this. Don't do 180 degree turns off of ladders. It's so janky. And it's a gun, so I need it. Oh, man. Um, do I need to shoot something here? The board. What if I waste all my ammo here? And I don't shoot the board. Can I crowbar it? I can crowbar it. Okay. And then getting out of here is weird, because I'm getting on the ladder. That's a little janky. Is there another grub somewhere? Or is it... There is. Hello, little guy. I'll be back to squish you later. Maybe. Alright. I know I need a turn wheel thingy. Stairs look kind of odd. Um, I like the copious use of stairs. This is actually something I was pl I had an idea for a map for after playing through some um, Uncharted 4 recently. I noticed that they straight up use like tons of stairs everywhere, even in like a little hallway. They'll just have like an elevation change just for poops and giggles. And I was like, ah, oh, yeah, it's it's pretty effective. All right, so we're still looking for a uh, orange turn wheel thingy. Um, 
Double tap. Gotta make sure. You never know. You never know. Um. Hmm. That's kind of odd. Let's fence off this area. Be pretty neat if there's something hidden under one of these things. You probably want the player to have the gravity gun in that case, though. Um, alright, I have reached the boundary of where I can go to. There's this room, there's this room, there's this room, and then there's everything we've been in. Ah! I did not see you. Trixie little thing. Um. Hmm. Was it? Uh, uh, okay. Uh. Nope. It was downstairs. Turn. Turn. I don't know what this is opening. Sounds rather heavy. I'm assuming it's that big door in the... at the bottom where all the water was? Or it's raising the elevator? Let's assume it's raising the elevator. It's raising the elevator. Um... Okay. I don't know what my goal is here, though. What am I trying to get to? What if I lower it and I can't get out of here? What if I just did what I was afraid of doing? Nope, I can slightly get out of there. Um, I don't remember where that thing was. Let me let me try to figure out where my bearings here. Aha! Alright, so that's what it is. Okay, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Um, I, I'm understanding in hindsight that you need to raise the ladder because you can't get into the grate because of this, um... Uh, whatever this is. This static grate. <laughs> you need to, you need to raise the elevator because the static grate is blocking the dynamic grate so you can get in here. Um... That was, uh... Hmm. All right. I didn't do that puzzle with intention. I, I kind of stumbled on it. Um, I think that's about it. I hear you. These lights are so bright. Oh. All right. False alarm. Everyone's dead. Hmm. Okay.
Oh, there's Alex. You're welcome. Shields went down. Am I going the right way now? I think the other way was just a door texture door. There Hello. You are. I thought you might have forgotten about me. Okay, let's go. Pretty good. Um, nice detailing in the area. Uh, some some kind of odd geometry bits, but not not a deal breaker by any means. Um, the puzzle was. I mean, I I got the I got I got it afterwards. I just I wasn't figuring out the solution with intention. Like ah, that's what I need to do. I need to I need to do this. Um, it. I think all the elements were there. Like the great next to the turn wheel like you could see that the elevator was moving up and down which is about as good as you can get without like p hooking up a monitor or maybe changing the location of the um turn wheel and stuff um and for a for a 70 something hour competition this was um very cohesive so that was pretty good i like that now i'm getting telemarketing calls Go away. Hard yard. Hard yard is next. Eliminate combine snipers. Rescue five gnomes. No third objective? Alright, so we got a crowbar. We got a green light over there. We got a gnome over here. You have been rescued. Oh, it just dis. Okay, cool. Um, I guess let's go hit the green light thingy. That's probably not a good idea. Do I need to like jump up in there or something? Um, should probably seal the world there. Okay, there's hopper mines there. I could probably technically make it past those, but I don't really want to tempt fate here. Um. Hmm. Is that critical path here? Past hopper mines when you have a crowbar? Yeah. I don't know about this. It was a gnome, so maybe maybe not. Uh, there's another gnome in that truck. I can see him. Um, I'm afraid I'm gonna I'm gonna get shot like one shot or one hopper mine and I'm and I'm dead pretty much Hmm I am unsure of what I'm supposed to do here Was there another like path through here? It all just went to the trains. I couldn't do anything else differently in here. Um. The red light was where we started, I think. Yeah. It's locked, can't get in there. 
unless I need to come back up here to jump into the train door that we just opened since I couldn't get in there from the lower end. This is the answer, okay. Um, now where? I have no idea. box or something. Don't shoot me. That's not good. I have no health and no weapons. They should have seen me. These guys, all the enemies in Half-Life have ridiculous vision cones. High voltage, that's probably significant. Placement of garbage over a barrel. Uh, that's pretty interesting. Alright, um, I'm gonna follow the wires here. I, I guess that's. That's leading me nowhere. Okay, thanks. Door, maybe? Very inconspicuous sound. They know I'm coming now. I see you, but you're not engaging me. Are you stuck? Can I assist you? I could not assist him. It's pretty cramped for these, like, ginormous props. Um, I would have gone with more small stuff. Like these cinder blocks! I'm not really able to use them effectively. Looks nice though. so well up until this point. 
Ah. How many gnomes did we find? I didn't... I didn't eliminate the sniper. Did I eliminate the snipers? I guess I did. Do I really want to... Alright, let's just go get this thing. I think I got like three, maybe? Should we look around? Let's set a hard limit. I'm gonna look around for... three minutes. There's one. How do I get to you? Are you an electric... Okay. Dang it, it's hard to jump on that. But I turned off the power. The shield turned back on. What the what the hell? Why did the shield turn back on? So I'm I'm screwed. I can't go back in. I broke your I broke your I broke your level. <laughs> um Why does the shield turn back on? I can't jump up on this. I, I can't, like, move forward from here? There's a trigger push. Um, let's just... Rails freaking hate mods because they do all this stupid crap. Where is it? Um... And that shield went back up as well. No, never mind. Elevator, that's why, because I can't get it back on the elevator. Nope, never mind. You can barely see this button here. Not entirely sure why that um, gate went back up. Like, it, it makes. doesn't make sense to me. I don't know if that was intentional or not. Like, how am I supposed to get back up here if I jump out with a... with the shield back on? Unless I'm missing something. Some other secondary way to drop the shield or something? I don't know. And then we have to do this thing with the elevator three times? I don't know. I... Hmm. I think I would have made it so that you could jump back up from the um, from that one that I just got, because the player figured it out, right? They they understood, um, they understood, like, all right, I gotta I gotta jump down there and stuff, and just let them jump back up. Nothing nothing breaks from that. Um, I don't know how many we got. I think we only got like four, but let's just end this. For reals? You didn't even say, like, the gnomes threw a party in my honor, or you you missed one gnome, so he's hell-bent on revenge against you for the rest of your life, or anything like that? Alright, then. Um, I like the aesthetics of it. It's pretty nice. Um. Uh.
combat was was decent until that one that one spot where like the four people just rushed at me that was that was kind of weird and different from everything else up until that point um minor changes that I would recommend for the for hunting down the collectibles like letting you get back up I don't know why that shield went back up and stuff um doesn't seem like that was necessary it seems like you just you you break the the level if you can't go back I don't know anyways uh that's going to be it for now thank you for watching everybody hope you enjoyed it until next time take care bye bye how come the music isn't going I don't know whatever